Hello and welcome back to Metro. Which one? Eh, the new one, of course. Thank you for watching. I hope you're enjoying the set so far. Now we're going to go up this lovely tower and we're going to, uh, you know, fly down the zip wire. Sounds like fun. Might involve more murder. Woo woo! We love murder. You know, you know, Metro murder, not like real murder. Now, thankfully, because the game is idiot proof and I can't fall off ladders, we can make it up here pretty efficiently. Uh, oh, we still gotta go up further? Hmm. Maybe not 100% idiot proof. Almost idiot proof. I don't know where this goes, but I thought we should take a look. So let's have a nosy where the zip wire takes us. I think it might lead to the other side of that facility we were on earlier, but that could lead to some cool goodies. Which is always worth though. Hey, big fella! Uh oh. Well, oh, it's kinda lucky that thing slowed down, huh? I mean, I would have gone face first of the metal. Ooh, dead people. Neat. Okay. Artem's got peg legs, so let's actually go down the ladder rather than jumping off, shall we? Alright. Uh, now, somebody told me that the baddies might be attracted to the light, which is really interesting. So, if I see any electrical zappy dudes, I should definitely turn off my light. Thank you for all the hints and tips, by the way. I'm trying to take them in in uh, as much as I can. Oh, that looks bad. Hmm. Let's avoid those guys, shall we? Well, this is where we ran into the zappy fella last time. Oh, there it is. Sure enough. And apparently, if I have my if I have my light off and stand still, I might not get zapped. So, that's worth a look, right? Uh, well, let's not risk it. Let's keep our light off when we're outside, shall we? Kind of figured there'd be more goodies out here. I kind of want to have a look at that over there, but I'm a bit worried about the zappy ball. That could be really dangerous. There's a lot of dead things here as well. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna assume it's not all because of Mr. Zappy up there. I may test the uh, theory that staying still doesn't get you zapped. It's coming back this way, so... It's mus mecking up my uh, UI, but I'm not getting killed. So either this is working, or... This is tense. Okay, it's gone on my right side now. Cool, looked like it passed. Wow, it worked! Nice! Well, no friggin' goodies up there. What about over here? Come on, there's gotta be stuff here. Look at all this crap, and I can't pick up any- Oh! Really? One little bit? Oh, come on, give me a break. Oh, come on, Artyom, you can't- Ugh, whatever. Right, fine. It's not that dark out here. Presumably it'll be light soon. Actually, the time it's 4 o'clock in the morning, so yeah, it will be. Which is good, because seeing out here is a pain in the ass. Well. This all looks pretty gribbly. And pretty underwatery. It's swampy out here, but it doesn't seem to be completely underwater. Uh. I'm a little bit wary about doing this, but. We haven't sank yet. Hey, Miller. I guess that's the X, the big X. The te we need to go get a teddy bear too, because, you know, obviously. Careful, this could be trapped. Uh, this looks risky. Okay, well that seemed somewhat pointless. I guess I can turn this on? I'm not sure if it's a good idea. Maybe I need more petrol. Maybe that's what the shaking's about. Is it's out of gas. Yeah, it's out of gas. 
Okay. Thank you, Artem. I've worked that out already. So we need to go find some petrol. Oh well, let's check the two obvious ones that are right next to it that almost certainly won't be full of gasoline, but hey. Sure enough. Alright. Well, I don't know what this will get us, but this could be the way to the loot. Could be a vault. That man we rescued did say there was some loot around here. Sure enough, that looks like a workshop full of goodies. Hold on. Let me... Oh, we're actually fairly charged. Okay. Ah, it's made out of friggin' wood. Could just kick the door down. Well. That's a pooper. Don't really want to go in there. To fire. And then I saw that huge thing. Like, real huge. It was straight for us. Clanging, shrieking, smoke everywhere. Okay, let's not spook him. To say, Lord, save us. And it broke through. Hey, guys. We were lucky we got away alive. Ah, oh, will you just look at what the cat dragged in? Um, that's rude. A heretic. Oh, god damn it. Well, I'll be. He doesn't turn his satanic light on us. His gun is holstered. He's a human after all. Even though he is a heretic, he has some sense even. His soul may not be completely You guys lost. have the same face. You wish. Do they even have a soul, them heretics? I am right here, guys. Look at his armor. Yeah, that's a work of Satan, all right. I wish our paladin said something like that, though. Of course, blessed by Father Salentius. We'd never have lost the train depot or the tower to those bandits. We'd still have it all, and they'd all be in hell. We'd be cutting them down like dogs. It is temptation. Temptation by technology and its satanic power. You're right. But really, damn. Well, I made a good impression-ish, I guess. I'm gonna be a dick now. I'm sorry, did I put your fire out? That was a really heretic thing of me to do. Oh, I'm sorry, did I turn your lamp out? That was a really heretic thing of me to do. Sorry, guys. Assholes. Okay, I can't sneak under here. We made a good impression. So that's about as good as it gets. Now let's see if we can find any of this gasoline. Oh, there's another boat. Guess we could always use that to cross. Praise be the fish, indeed, brothers. Praise be the fish. Now, more importantly, does it, can this heretic find some working gasoline? Oh, apparently that's not it. That doesn't count. Well, there were some amazing tips on having a shotgun instead of a that weird little pooty thing I had. So, I'm going to modify the shotgun. Also, I'm going to make me some more... Um, oh, my filters are actually getting a little bit low. Let's craft. It's quite expensive one filter, actually. Okay, we're... Eh, we'll, f we'll have four. Okay, we got plenty of shotgun shells and everything. Okay, cool. Right. Uh... The shotgun's kind of dirty, so let's clean it first of all. Let's go with all this grime. There we go. We're now grime free. Short barrel. Double barrels. Double barrels, of course. Reflex sight. No gadget. No less gadgets, less problems. Cool. Well, not exactly uh, state of the art, but it'll do. Ooh, standard barrel and compensator. That looks nice. And an extended magazine. Now that sounds very useful. Okay, did I actually install the thing I wanted to do on this? There we go. Alright, and nothing on this was there. Otherwise we're all clean, right? Well, let's quickly clean it. There we go. 
Otherwise, I think we're good to go. There's nothing else I can do here, is there? Nah. Alright, fine. Okay, no gasoline, sure, but hey. The shotgun could be very useful against muties. And we got a new crafting station, which is kind of handy. Now, more importantly, where the hell are we going to find some gasoline? It's a shame we can't sneak in here, which it looks like I can, but there's a door, but I'm guessing that's related to the door in here. So if I'm going to return, restore power to this place, I'm going to have to find some gas. That is obvious. Unfortunately, there doesn't seem to be any obvious gas around here, so that kind of scuffs my problem. Now... What, are, what is a shed? Is there anything in here? Ah, there is a tank here. Aha. Uh -huh. Let's check it. Does it wiggle? Lovely. Good work, Artyom. Alright. Let's fill up the, uh, the old gas tank then. I know, I know. Technological heretic and all that, but... Oh, I'm not sure about throwing that on the ground. I'd move it slightly further away, but hey. Alright. Ladies and gentlemen, we have power. Not sure how long for, so let's make the most of it, shall we? Alright. Let's open this. Beautiful. Don't know what we're going to find in here, but... I'm sure it's going to be useful. Lovely. Oh, yeah, this was totally worth the effort. I guess this is the stash the guy was talking about. Okay, this way's locked. Well, that scratches that then. There's something in there, that's for sure. Maybe I need to follow the power around. Maybe I can do something extra with it. Maybe not. Okay, I can't turn this one for some reason. Guess there's not enough juice. Mm. Well, something to come back to, I suppose. Right. Okay. Across the water, we've got another question mark, and we've got the bear over there. Well, what if I take the boat, attempt not to get eaten by the fish, and make my way over to that, uh, that thing? That's probably the next best thing to do. Oh, there's Mr. Fish. Hopefully he won't be bothering me too much. I'm not sure how much hope I'm going to have with that, but you never know. I don't see another good way to get across there, frankly. Well, I could just go to the next shore. That'll take me on land everywhere I need to go. Hey! Oh, you guys are such assholes. Coward. Well, that friggin' did the job, didn't it? Little assholes. Okay, let's get in the boat. Let's go. Less time we spend in the water, the better, frankly. <laughs> Shove off, dude. Sorry, Artie, you're just gonna have to put up with it till we get to the other shore. Cool. Right, we should be able to get from here. There we go. Alright, oh, I have to heal. Dirt bags. Ooh. Ah, oh, guy died on the crapper. That is a bad way to go, my friend. He's giving me a thumbs up though, so nice. Thumbs up to you too, sir. Thumbs up to you too, sir. Alright. That didn't hit me, did it? Just splashed. There's a lot of blood around here. I guess these, these guys got killed by that giant monster. Well, what killed the giant monster? That's the question. Well, that's giant-ish, I guess. Oh, I tell you, this shotgun's doing the business. Alright, it's not spitting at me. It's a jerk from the water. Probably gonna have to heal again. 
no such luck, eh? But. Hey, dead guy! To be honest, I mean. Well, I just want to check into this school burst. Asshole. There we go, got him. Doesn't look like there's anything goody wise in there. What about in this tractor? Oh, come on, that didn't hit me. That was a scam. It doesn't look like it does an awful lot of damage, but it does enough to leave the, like, tomato sauce on my screen. And I do not want to be bobbed, so... Tomato sauce be gone! With the Q button. Along with some weird LOD details. Hmm. Strange. Definitely don't have that many shotgun shells left. But we polished off a few big mutants. So that's all good. And it's getting nice and bright, so I can turn my torch off for a change. Oh shit. Yeah, my kingdom for a science, though, I tell you. Where did that guy go? There was a guy there. Friggin' disappeared. I am not going crazy. There was a dude walking, then he vanished. <laughs> this gonna end in tears. Hello! Let's get rid of the sentries first, I guess. I am the world's best ninja. Connardi. Let's fucking toast this dude. What up, bitch? Whoop. I mean, you say knock him out, but, you know. Oh, he's probably fine. 